Hi honeys, how's your day going so far? Mine is going fine. We're getting ready to make some chili. It's kind of cool here today. And uh, I got a taste for some chili. I love chili. I love it. But anyway, I'll be using, I was going to make, I had bought a roll of uh, ground beef. And Walter said, that's not enough meat. So I got this. So that was a one pound. This is 2.25 pounds of chili. I mean hamburger. And it's the 93 lean 7% fat. So I won't have to be dipping out grease. Okay. I always like to use different color beans. So I'm using the the light red chili beans, dark red, wait a minute, this is the chili beans. Here's the dark red kidney beans, and here's the light red kidney beans. All right, I'll be using my salsa, chunky salsa. I got everything chopped up in it already. Um, I'm gonna add extra granulated onion and granulated garlic pepper and three packs of chili seasoning mix okay and we always have our chili with oyster crust crackers and I like my chili soupy some people like it real thick but I like it soupy I like my spaghetti soupy too okay so I'm going to open all this and I'll be back. I'm just going to wipe off these cans. And okay, I'll be using my Presto electric skill. Okay, I just put it back this morning where I store my uh kitchen ga gadgets. I had no idea I was going to be making chili in it. I'll just plug this in. The heating element thing. Now I'm going to plug this into the wall. Okay. We'll put the meat in. Let me turn it on. Turn it on to 300. Just meet in right quick. I really don't need to use all this meat. I always make so much food. But I'm going to use it. Smells fresh. I always keep a garbage bag. Okay. I'm going to open this stuff. Chili, just the dark red chili kidney beans. I use juice and all, yeah. I'm using the chili beans. Let me see if I got the the kind I really like. Um, nope. I like the Joan of Arc brand a lot. You know what? Walter don't like the chunky salsa because it got stuff in it. But I do. This is the chili beans. It has the thick sauce. Think, do I want to use the sauce because everything is in it. The hubby don't like it. Put the 
careful with that. You're supposed to use one pack of seasoning mix per pound of meat. So I have two and a quarter pounds of meat, but I'm using three packs because I'm adding all these beans. So it won't be too salty. And I do this all the time. Okay. Trying to decide when we use the salsa or not. I never season my ground meat um, before it's done. I season it after it's done. If I were to put a packet of this in here now, that would color the meat. I wouldn't be able to see when it's done. Plus, it'll be just fine if I season it after it's done. That's what I do. I have a hamburger breaker upper. After the meat gets a little more done, then I'll use it. So I won't have these big chunks of meat. That's some good news. Well, my daughter is blessing me with something for my birthday. My birthday is in July. And I'm kind of overwhelmed. But I'll tell y'all when I'm not so overwhelmed. I'm really overwhelmed when I got my hundred thousand subscriber silver plaque couldn't really really talk about it I'm happy and overwhelmed at the same time water. Whenever you use any of these packets, you need to add a liquid. I want to use pasta sauce. So I can use one of these instead of my salsa, but it's going to taste different. This is the tomato and basil prego. I see the date. Do it till 2024. This expired April 2022. I'm throwing away my stuff, y'all. Yeah. Still good. I don't want to use this. I'm just use a little salsa. That's what I'll do. But this tastes different. Different flavor profile. Still gonna be good. Cause I know how to season the heck out of food. And I don't mean adding more salt. Okay, when this meat is done, I will be back. Okay, y'all. Um, I'm using this. Uh, I'm filming. I'm using this hamburger breaker upper thingamajig. So, meat is just about done. I never use this on raw meat because the raw meat will just stick all in here. And I don't want that. So 
just need it nice and lean. Okay, we'll season it. I forgot to tell you, I'm going to be adding a little of this Nora Chicken Bouillon Powder. It seasons good. So you don't need a lot of salt when you use this. Because you know how bouillon cubes taste. Let me use, how much is this? A teaspoon. That's it. Along with this other stuff. You know, this got salt in it. Three packets. Got to add some water. I'm going to add some more onion powder. No salt in that. Garlic powder, no salt in that. Of course, pepper, y'all. Yeah. Shouldn't be shaking it over this because that steam is getting up in here. And I know better, but I'm doing it anyway. Let me put the water in here now. Well, I'm going to add the beans. I'll rinse out these cans with the water. Yeah, I like a lot of beans. Some people don't put beans in theirs at all. I'm trying to add the water. Half a can. I'm gonna add a little more. I'm gonna add the sauce. good. It don't smell good until I add the seasoning. Okay, it's going to need a little more water. Use the Prego tomato basil garlic. There's no big chunks in here. Mm -hmm. Always listen for the top to pop. So sometimes people open stuff in the store. Yeah, put the top back on and set it back on the shelf. I'm just going to use a little of that. I'm going to use a little of this. Oh, it smells good. So this is what the bell peppers, the onions, the jalapenos, and all that's in it. But I'm not using that much. So this man won't be having fits. Okay. Mmm. -hmm. A little soupier than that. This electric skillet holds a lot. I'm not sure if it's the 11 inch or the 12 inch one. I 
I got mine from Walmart. It's twenty-six dollars. The ones they sell on Amazon, they cost so much more. I'm gonna taste this to see what it needs. Oh my! Mm -mm 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 -mm. So what's this here sauce? That's what it needs. Man, be quiet. Whatever's in it, you gonna eat it. He's talking about no onions. Taste it again to see what it needs. Oh. It needs something. Oh, you know what? It has another flavor profile because I added that prego. Okay, I need something else. Make it taste like I want it to taste. Look what I need. <clears throat> Italian seasoning. I like the other Italian seasoning better. Right here. Basil, I like basil. I want this stuff start popping all over the place. This is the Italian seasoning. No salt in here. This flavor. And what is this? The Italian seasoning and the basil. in here. Yeah, come up. Don't want to add too much basil. Got some celery seed in there too. Celery seed. Not that much. Pinch. Now it needs a little sweetness to it. I don't put sugar in my food. I may have to add some ketchup. Sweeten out this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm using a different finger each time I taste it. So I ain't contaminating my food. Ketchup got sugar in it. This in here. This is old. chunks of onion and stuff in here right now. The water show sure won't be looking. That's why he can't swallow bell peppers and onion. But he eat everything else. Told me full of stuff. Let me taste it. That's good. Needs a little salt. Let me let this simmer. I will be back. 
Okay. I turn the fire way down. It needs a little sup. So I'm going to add a half a teaspoon of this. So that's the salt. About that much. I got my bowl ready and some black pepper. Add a little red pepper. This is the crushed red pepper. And it's not going to be too spicy. Let these flavors simmer together. I make good chili, y'all. My mama used to make delicious chili. That's where I got my love of chili from. Okay. That's perfect. Gonna warm this little summer. Don't need nothing else. Nothing. It's a big spoon. My big refrigerator. Okay, the chili is done. Excuse me for reaching in front of y'all. Uh -oh. Got some pizza blend uh, cheese. I've been looking for the mozzarella and cheddar blend it don't say it on the packet no more it just says pizza blend and that's what's in it mozzarella and cheddar so so y'all been looking for it get the pizza blend i like those two cheeses together electric skillet. It doesn't heat up the house. Take a 
on there. Here's my chili. Put in my electric skillet. Okay. Okay. Dip me up some. Well, my honey's blessed me with this ladle. It's a wooden ladle. My honey's blessed me with that other wooden spoon I was using. And a fork, wooden fork came with it. Okay, that should do me. Makes him a uh, separate bowl with oyster crackers in it. I like to put mine in here. Oh, that's a lot. It's too hot to taste. Y'all be waiting for me to do to do the taste test. But it's hot. This is my chili bowl I bought from Walmart. I think it was three dollars. Okay. I love chili. Good chili. Mm. Let me taste just the chili without the cheese. I'm going to shake some hot sauce in here. This is good. Mm -mm -mm. Just a little. Mm -mm -mm. This is delicious, y'all. Very, very good. Very, very good. been in here three times to see if it's done yet. Good eating. So I want to thank you all for watching. Give me a thumbs up. Leave a nice comment. Because I'll be getting some terrible comments y'all. And I try to get rid of them. And block the people before y'all see them. I don't know why they mean to me. I don't mess with nobody. But anyway, y'all know what to do. Be blessed and bon appetit. Bon appetit. Bye.